Hey, good morning, y'all. About to start a new hunt today. We got a guest this morning, beautiful Dogo up there. We got Mulata, oh, baby. We got Siren, Orion, the puppy. We're gonna let him go and see if we got we got something this week. Yeah, it's still dark, yeah. <laughs> I thought that was a... <laughs> Sorry. No, it's okay. Yeah, I'm not really good for you. <laughs> So we, we got the dogs baying in there, so it we'll see. Like a lot more was coming out. We'll see if they get something stopped. Johnny's still in there. He's about 50 though. It sounds like that's not water though. No, that's the canes. Really? Yeah. Sorry. No, 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 you can talk. Good boy, Orion. Go get him. There's little Orion, that's the puppy. Look at him searching, putting his nose to the ground. So we're seeing progress quickly with him. All right, I'll update y'all if, uh, if we get on something. They're working in there. They were definitely chasing something just a minute ago. They got one caught. They're right across here. I just gotta get through this water. Okay, my buddy's there. Sounds like he's there. We'll go help him out. I'm a, a little late. It's a good, good fat sow. Hey, buddy. Good boy. Talk about getting What's his wet. name again, Johnny? Johnny. Good boy. Good boy, Johnny. You like that, huh? Good boy. I came in here. You only dog. Got a good on fat it. sow. All right, we're gonna move on because uh, I definitely saw one that passed me out in the open. So hopefully we can get another one stopped. Oh boy, buddy. Just wanted to show you guys uh, how well trained he is also. Look at him just being a good boy. He knows what a caught hog means. The job is done. Let it go, we take over and he's being good and patient. Beautiful, love to see that. You've done a good job with him. Thank you. <laughs> Good boy. Breeding stable temperatures. So there's a good Dogo Ar Argentino right there for all of you Dogo lovers that keep hitting me up. <laughs> there you go. And by the way, you guys been asking me about that last Dogo that I brought that we uh, that we tried to work with. Uh, that was a rescue. Oh, we got the dogs. We got the dogs banging another one. Catch him. Catch him. I right, keep him, keep him, keep him, cause that Wait. she doesn't, she doesn't have it yet. Wait. Lo mando. Sí, mando. No, no, no. Lo llevo ahí, compadre. She's chasing one right now. Let's see if she can get it stopped, and then we'll send him in. Anyway, what I was saying about the last dogo that he just didn't work out, and uh, it's it was his dog too. Not, not his dog, we were rescuing him. We were gonna look for a pet home for him, but we tried to make it work, it didn't work out. So he did find a pet home for the Dogo. So he's he's got a good home where he's gonna live as a pet. So that's the best you can hope for um, when they don't work out here. But this boy's got what it takes for sure. He's doing great and he's pretty new at it too. Doing great. And that's how it is with any breed, guys. I say the same thing about my Corsos. Just because it's, you know, whatever. Insert your breed doesn't mean that they're going to work out guaranteed. It takes certain things, you know. It takes certain grit, bravery. 
that sounds good. Okay, see, see if he'll go. Another one just passed us. Okay. They got one. They got one. He got it. He got it. Let's go. Right behind you. That's the dogo that just connected with us. So we're going to get to him as soon as we can now. Good boy. So right when we were talking, we got the second one. Good boy. Go, come on. They got another one, guys. I just let Siren go for this one. Go. Hey, do me a favor and bring rope. You got rope on you? What? You got rope? Uh, in my back. Bring some rope. They got it caught. Get him, baby. Go get him. Catch him. Catch him. Catch him. Oh. Okay, they got him. There he is. See the difference from when the Carahula gets him and the doggo? <laughs> Yeah. Hey, you still got the rope? No. I'll go get it. Right. Here you go. Here you go. Hey. I'll be, I'll be right back. All right. Catch him, the ball. That's why I didn't. That's why I didn't like it. Just saying. Good boy, catch him. Hold that hog, Donnie. Hold that hog. Good boy. Good boy. Good sow. Good boy. 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 Good boy.
Now the hard part. Johnny, move. Vamos. Uh. Ahora un poco para darme el leash. Leave it. Anything you have to say for yourself. <laughs> Great hunt. Did you have fun? Yeah. Awesome. The dogs did good. The dogo did awesome. Good boy, Johnny. Good boy. Yeah, the dogs, the dogs all did great. We're proud of every single one of them. Uh, that right there, guys, is uh, <laughs> where I got bit by a hog today. It was one of the one of the last ones we got. I think I I barely remember now. Anyway, it's been a while since I got a little bite from a hog. Good thing it wasn't some big nasty boar, but that's what happens when you mess up just a little bit. Don't time correctly. She got loose enough where uh, she had that one opportunity and she didn't miss. But all in all, great hunt. We had a real fun time. I think our guest, you know, she had a, a great time as well with her dog, with the Dojo Argentino. Um, she actually breeds Dojo Argentino. She is a actual breeder. So, you know, I, I love hearing of breeders that have these working dogs that actually want to make sure that their dogs are functional working dogs that are trying to keep those traits that they were bred for alive. I love seeing that. So I was more than happy to bring her along and um, and uh, and of course have her bring one of her dogos that she wanted to work with. And he did great. He did fantastic. Um, she actually told me that he was, you know, some people had told her before when he was younger and he, you know, he got on the first hog that I guess he didn't do too well. And some people were saying that he was no good. And hey, honestly, He's probably the best Dogo Argentino that I've seen in a while. I, I've had, you know, I have many people that, you know, come and try out their dogs with us. And, you know, different breeds. 
and it's not as simple as people think you know just because it's a certain breed does not mean that the dog is gonna work and it's gonna you know go and catch a, a wild hog a wild boar especially there your instincts are you know to survive most animals have those the, the same survival instincts you know to preserve their life so it's not every dog that runs towards that danger and fights it head on but this doggo did just that he did great so i was happy to see that and catch it on film for you guys as well i know how many many of you love doggo argentinos i love them as well um, i love all breeds my only thing is you know it's kind of annoying when people that clearly don't hunt don't don't actually work dogs they try to give you advice on what dogs are good oh no your your dog's no good you know the the cane corso now nah, forget that man don't go argentino's where it's at or presa canario that's where it's at they're they're guaranteed to work no, no dog is guaranteed to work okay um some dogos are great some aren't like for example the last dogo that we that we uh, tried to um, that we we're finding a pet home for it was a rescue and we decided you know what before we find him a pet home let's take him to the woods let's see if, if he works if he's if he's a good working dogo then shoot we'll keep him we could use another good you know running catch dog and he didn't work out you know we some of you have asked me in the comment section so I, I figured I it's a good time to address it now um, he didn't work out so my buddy who was holding him who had him in his home uh, my hunting buddy he found him a home so he's you know he's in a in a good pet home he's just gonna live a a pet dog's life okay you know and that's 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 the reality that's the majority of cases honestly a lot of them don't are not really cut out for this kind of work and uh, no matter the breed you know certain breeds are you know going to give you a higher percentage but nothing's guaranteed just because it's x breed um so anyway i digress we had a great hunt the dogs worked awesome i'm glad i got some footage of a good dog argentino working um for you guys and i'm glad that the owner was there to enjoy that as well i know how proud she was to see you know to see him turn on today the way he did so that, that was awesome and you guys will probably see them again you know she'll probably come hunt with us uh, in the future again maybe bring another one of her dogos and maybe you know we'll, we'll talk a little bit more about dogo argentinos from her side you know as a breeder maybe do like a little hunt slash interview type of thing for those of you that that watch this channel for the dogs and are interested in the dogs working dogs um i know that's my passion that's my love you know that's why i do this more than anything so if you guys are interested in that let me know in the comment section make sure you hit the like subscribe if you haven't and i'll catch you guys on the next hunt hope you enjoyed